Prawn cocktail, together with the Murray Rose sauce, is a British dish invented in the 1960s. This recipe goes back to the retro roots of prawn cocktail, with an easy Marie Rose sauce, keeping it simple and tasty. The ingredients you will need for four people are 300 grams of cooked peeled prawns, one lettuce, one lemon, Marie Rose sauce, which you can make very easily yourself. To make the Marie Rose sauce, also known as prawn cocktail sauce or fish sauce, add three measures of salad cream or mayonnaise to one measure of tomato ketchup. I'm using a dessert spoon here because I'm only going to make the one prawn cocktail. Mix it together. Make sure it's pink enough and taste it to make sure it's as you like it. Touch more tomato sauce I think. and it tastes better. Well, there you have it. Shred the lettuce. For an iceberg lettuce, cut it in half. Throw away the outer leaves and any that don't look quite good enough. Take out the core. And shred. With a large lettuce head like this you might want to consider dicing the lettuce so that uh, your guests can eat it comfortably with a teaspoon. Wash and dry the lettuce. I used to serve this dish in very large seashells. People used to say it tasted fishier. Such is the power of suggestion. But I gave the seashells away some years ago as I no longer entertain. So I'm reduced to using glass dishes, which is how it was originally served. Arrange the lettuce in the bottom of your serving glasses or bowls. Pile your prawns on top. And spoon the sauce over the prawns. Alternatively, you could put the prawns in the sauce mix them all up so they're all coated and then spoon the mixture over the lettuce.
Garnish with a lemon wedge. Top and tail the lemon. Cut it in half. Then put two or three cuts in each half. Two cuts will make six, six wedges. Three will give you eight. Cut away the pith and get rid of the seeds. Make a small cut between the flesh and the skin so the wedge will sit up in the glass bowl. Heat it with a teaspoon and perhaps a small fork like a cake fork. Put the bowl on the plate so that guests have somewhere to discard the lemon peel and the cutlery when finished with. Serve with triangles of brown bread and butter, preferably in a dish or on a plate, not in the packet. Nowadays retro food is cool again, but keep it simple. 